Hi, this is Tina Hughes from builderwebsitetonight.com. In this quick video, I'm going to show you how to add an image to one of your pages in your WordPress.org website. Let's pop over to the dashboard now. In the previous lesson, I showed you how to add a page to your website and it's called that page how to add a page to your website appropriately now what I'm going to do is show to show you how to add an image to this page first thing I need to do is choose the location I would like an image to be at the left of the word today so I'm going to click to the left of the word today and I'm going to select to install an image so I click. Now just above the menu bar you can see Upload Insert. The very first icon is Add an Image so I'm clicking that. I'm then presented with a window that says Add Media Files from your computer. Now the file I want to upload I can find by clicking on the button Select Files and it tells me here that the maximum upload size is 64 megabyte. I've navigated to the folder where I have some images and I'm going to choose one to upload. I'm going to choose the camera guy by double clicking on it. So I can see now that it's being uploaded. You can tell by the percentage how far along it is. When the file has finished uploading it brings in some information. It tells you the upload date which is today, what type of file it is, what the name of it is that I had on my desktop and it automatically gives it a title. Now this is your opportunity to type something for the search engines. So I'm going to say photographer with camera taking photos for my website. Now this particular uh, photo isn't anything special it's just for the demo purposes but if you're uploading a product or information about one of your services then you would use your keywords here. Now I'm also going to uh, scroll down a little bit and it's asking me uh, the alignment. No alignment, just insert it, left alignment, centre, right, full size or another size. Now I'm actually going to choose left alignment which means that the text is going to wrap around it. So you can see in this little example here the red represents the photo with the text floating around it. So that's what we're going to go for. So click on left. You can now see that there's a blue dot for left. I'm going to put in full size and I'm going to click on the insert into post or page. Same thing. And there it is. It has been inserted. Now it's a little bit hard to see the page here so I'm going to show you another little trick when you're in this area where you're editing your pages there's an icon here that looks like a little computer screen so you can toggle between large screen and the reduced screen so click on that and there you go you can see the full screen fantastic now there is a border showing there that is removed once I clicked away from it so I'm quite happy with that I'm going to uh, go back to normal mode so to be able to publish that I have to click on the toggle full screen button again takes me back to the normal size of the screen moving over here to click on the update button page updated message appears I'm going to click on the button view page And there it is. There's the image with the text flowing around it. That's it for this lesson. This is Tina Hughes from builderwebsitetonight.com saying cheerio for now. I'll see you in the next video.